have a dream. That's a good graduation day. Here we are at Liberty about to celebrate the completion of our first prototype. We've had nine students working in three teams over eight weeks to take the app ideas that they came up with and bring them to life with the help of mentors who've actually helped to code them and develop the apps and get them available on the Android market. CDI, as you probably all know, is actually a global network, um, which was set up in 1995 by Rodrigo Baja in Brazil. It's now operating in 13 countries and 1.3 million people have been trained around technology and citizenship. Um trabalho que foi muito inovador. Eu conheci o trabalho do CDI. I heard the CDI course back in the, uh, the favela where I grew up and I still live in there until present day. Em 1999, eu tive uma nova mudança na minha carreira profissional. In 1999, CDI gave me a chance to be one of the teachers and I changed my life completely. Pois um pouco do trabalho do CDI Ele está baseado em realizar sonhos, né? E eu sou eu sou um desses sonhos realizados através do trabalho de CDI. Of course, apps for good is no normal course. In fact, as you can probably see, we don't really do normal around here. I think we can all agree that it is a massively big deal for a developing country to come to a developed nation and introduce something so radically groundbreaking. It's not just pie in the sky, these are not just castles in the air, these are working implementations. This is binary code circling right around, <laughs> around microchips and interfaces and doing all kinds of cool stuff. A lot of kids are interested in music, well, okay, let's use music to get kids learning. This is the map, yeah, well basically it will show all the um, studios that are where you are. I say if there's a drummer, you wanted to know if there were like drums in the studio, you could type in drums there, you would search that. Oh, we kind of wanted to go with something simple, have our ideas, but at the same time, effective. You know what called Student Voice? The Student Voice is an app that enables students to search for relative information about a university of their choice. So yeah, what is Stop and Search? Stop and Search. Our app is about trying to help people know their rights when they get Stop and Search by the police. Also, we have to upload their experience, just building a bit of transparency so, so people know their rights. Roughly, you have 10, every 10,000 stops, only six actually resulted in an arrest. That meant there's a lot of innocent people that were kind of getting stopped and they were not really criminals. So, like, all of you guys, hopefully. <laughs> I thought all three of them were excellent. I, w I was blown away because what they've done, they've tapped into something that young people all can relate to. Well, I think it's just they live in a world and they've got their own issues and I have my issues in my world and they're not the same. And it's just really refreshing to talk to a bunch of guys who have a completely different outlook on life and therefore come up with all these amazing crazy ideas for apps that I would not have thought of. If you think about the number of mobile apps in the world, they're probably about half a million. The ideas that the guys came up with actually hadn't been done yet. There are young people out there who they have talent, they have abilities, and they have aptitude, and all they needed was an opportunity. If you are able to have the right structures around you and the right support networks, anything is possible. It's not like school, it's just you come in there, you do your thing, there's a pressure down you're like, come on school, school, like, you know what I mean, a classroom thing. Overall, I think it's a good course, and that, like, for me, I was fortunate to be on it. I've learned so much, um, we've learned about design, research, uh, feasibility, programming, branding ourselves. It's been like a bit of a rollercoaster ride, but it's been awesome. We've had some good feedback tonight, we've met a lot of really like, interesting people, so yeah, there's definitely life after, um, that's good. I got so much more out of it than I thought I was going to get. It's clearly something that's going to be here for a long, long time. It's going to change a lot of people's lives for the, for the better. I remember when you said we never make it to the top, yeah, that stayed in my memory. Only aided my energy. Finish lines a long way away, but we'll make it eventually. <laughs> I told you yeah, I was going to do it. I told you, told, but I didn't I believe it. Though. I told you, bro. I told you, regardless, man. Dream. Yeah. Easy with the words, you know. Make sure you keep a dream. Hey.